So, if you've been following me on this channel for a while now, you know that I am obviously a huge fan of The Amazing Race. I've been a fan since the second grade and that was when I was 7 years old. The thing that really appealed to me, especially as a child, was not only the traveling around the world every week, not just the challenges that we got to see every week, it was the props. <laughs> It was the merch. I was really into that stuff, you know? I loved seeing the pit stop mat at the end of the episode. I loved seeing the clue boxes everywhere. I loved seeing the race flags, the race colors. I even liked that little stand where you could tell what country that we were in. But the one thing that I absolutely loved about The Amazing Race was the clue envelopes. And now I have them here, unboxing right in front of you. So I bought them from this site on the screen. So obviously these aren't the actual clue envelopes from the race, I actually bought these from a party store that I found online and I had them shipped over here. And I just want to thank Julia and your aunt, thank you so much for helping me with this, thank you for sending them over here. And a quick story about these clue envelopes, so back when I was a kid, I loved like creating amazing race games for my cousins or for my friends and I always wanted to recreate the envelopes. I was kind of obsessed about it too. So my first prototype was like these plastic notebook covers and I would put yellow paper inside of them and I would seal them shut using electric tape. And it worked for a while, it looked pretty good and the reason I used plastic was that I could reuse them afterwards because I didn't want to keep remaking them, you know. So it worked for a while, but you know, the tape gets sticky, it starts leaving residue, and it just gets a lot more unpleasant towards the end. Eventually, I started printing them out on paper, just actual paper, but then I couldn't reuse them, it wasn't economical. <laughs> but you know, the one thing that I really could not recreate on any of the things I've done is the iconic tear. just like that and there's a clue I made just for this video and what does it say thanks for watching so if you guys want to buy these envelopes I have the link in the description just made a childhood dream come true it's kind of dorky I don't care hope you guys enjoyed the video